up my mic audio.
Fucking stop you. Need you on. Need you on. Get out of here. Yeah! Yeah! Here we go. Oh, shit. I gotta make the right monitor my primary display. Whoopsie daisy. Hold up. Or the game will launch behind me. And I do not want that. Cool. Thank you. Hopefully that didn't fucking destroy the stream when it fucking uh, switched like that, but I think it's probably okay. My mic's on you. Yeah, I did. Okay, cool. Everything is Gucci. It's time for vampires. It's vampire time. It's seven minutes? Yeah, I will. Got the song for the hold up. Hold up. That's better. Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. It's actually unfucking believable that they're making a sequel. Like, I finished the main campaign last night. This game is the jankiest fucking thing I've ever played in my life. But I guess, you know, you have a hard enough goth fan base and anything is possible, I suppose. Malkavians, everything is goofy for us. Okay. So this time, let's not walk in and steal a car stereo off of their desk because they weren't happy about yeah. that move yourself or i'll tear a hole in your shadow okay you can go on ahead and if you really want to make my night go ahead and start some shit in there because i would love it yeah i bet bud huh. your words echo in the vast emptiness of my head goodbye Let's see what we can scope out in here before I sabotage and kill all these drug dealers. I need to scoot the mic forward. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, see, I accidentally stole this last time. They were not having it. They weren't very happy. But I could hack into their computer, probably. I don't think I. I don't know if I have the computer skill. Oh. There's the cash. They're gonna aggro? No, they didn't know. Well, we got the money, but we still need the bomb. This is the room. That's what we need. Um. Alright. Let's try some. Oh. Yeah, listen up. Cash money up front, and that is non-negotiable in your case. So we're clear? I have got not one moral fiber restraining me against hitting a bitch should she get out of line. You understand? That said, what can I do to make you feel like the world is your bucket of fudge riffle with walnuts? What a terrible combination. <clears throat> Give me the astral light or your fun sack will become as fish. Okay, well, hey, it's worth a shot. Out, man. It's worth a shot. I didn't know it wouldn't work. Okay, yeah. I mean, Listen I up, probably should have been able to guess it wouldn't work, but that you know. is non-negotiable in your case. Yeah, um I need the astrolite. Ain't that a goddamn you know, you're the second person to ask for that tonight. Considering that's not a very popular item, 
I really got to wonder why you thought I might have some. I can see it behind you. Um, nothing matters. Give me the astrolite. Voices told me you had what I need, but maybe they were wrong. I heard your name on the midnight wind or when we last did. Uh, I mean, someone told me that you had the bomb, but I mean, if you don't got it, you don't got it. Got some stuff that'll do the trick. Where's my iPhone? It's like TNT's big Amina cousin with a prison record. I don't like keeping the stuff around too clean. Vampirism is legit no match from fucking for a gun like straight up it'll just mow me down like jack spends the entire tutorial talking about how guns aren't super effective on vampires but like it'll just fucking pop you oh i could fuck him for the ass for the bomb my fleet fleetwood mercury already paid for it do you not remember yeah see i think that's probably gonna get me in trouble my pockets are as empty as my head money is boring dude Hell no. It ain't worth a try. Every night I got some skis trying to hang it up on me for a hit. I wouldn't take that shit if you promised me a van upload. Damn. That was worth a shot. Um. Uh, my pockets are as empty as my head. My time? Huh, okay. Well. There are so many of them. Yeah, that's what I thought. Damn. Okay. Alright. Let's, uh, well, I mean, I did just take the money back anyway. I don't really oof, I want the money. Okay. Fine. Let's vampire it up. Okay, okay so I guess that doesn't work. Cash money. <laughs> I up guess I can't do that. that. Is -negotiable in your case. Okay. Yeah. I guess it breaks if I open the door. So I'll just this, right? Okay, I guess it's. I guess he has to see me. Front, and that is non-negotiable in your case. So we're clear. I have got not one moral fiber restraining me against kickbacks. Um. Let's talk about Mercury. Do you know the fleet-footed god? Fleet-footed god. Mercury, broken and bloodied. Mercurio. Yeah, we know him. We know Mercurio, don't we? How is our friend? He carries the scars of your betrayal. I come to take what is his. Is that a fat jack? Damn. Thanks, hey, hey, <sighs> Hmm, okay. Let's see if I can buy it back. That's not what I wanted. I quick saved there. Whoops. Shit. Oh, here we go. That's fine. Everything's okay. We're Daijobu. Okay, I can't. What if I blood buff first and get the stats? Then maybe he'll okay, yeah. fall for the intimidation. Cash money. That said, three giveth. <laughs> well, hey, I tried. This one, not the one where I'm getting shot at already. Okay, um, yeah, we'll see if we can't just pay him the money since we already stole the money out of the. Where's my blood buff? Did I miss it? Yeah, there it is. Okay, yeah. 
Uh huh. Uh -huh. Let's see. I want to buy the stuff. Ain't that a? Oh, they told me you had it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Can I not just pay him for it? Oh, that sucks. Mercurio. Damn. Okay. All right. Sneaky. Ah, oh, shit. It's this fucking quick save. All right. I don't know why it lets me have more than one quick save. Kind of defeats the point. Anyway. All right. Okay. I didn't want to resort to such underhanded tactics, but I mean, if it's what's gotta happen, it's what's gonna happen. Um. Mm -hmm. It's been real, homies. It's over here. Oh, it's so I can sneak in, but I don't really need to, because they let me in. Alright. There's a fucking dog over there? I never saw that fucking dog over there before. Holy shit. We'll just uh, shut the fucking power off in their house. You turned off the power. I was just about to unlock Shamalong. Fix the lights, damn it. You turn on the power, bitch. Fix the lights, Get the Al. lights or I'll shove that control up your ass, Al. Al. All right, man. Shield. We're gonna hide right behind here. Until they come to turn the power on, and then we'll fucking kill who turns the power turns the power on. Whoa, 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 why am I so visible? Okay, he's coming. Goddamn lights. Yikes. Yeah, we're not gonna... We're not about that. We'll just uh, systematically kill everybody instead. I mean, I, you know, I was trying to be a cool guy, you know, and help out or whatever, but this is what we gotta do. This is what we gotta do. Okay, I'll kill that guy last. Stability is so nuts. I guess if I turn the power off, it kicks, kicks him out of this room. Perfect. I should have done this from the beginning. This is a way better idea than the thing I did. Just fucking bounce. Yo, obfuscate is insane. Where's the ladder? Where's that? Here we go. Okay. Hello. That's free. And we got the cash. Damn. Better stealth system than Sekiro? D fucking dead ass. Spitting straight fucking facts right now. I need some. Uh, dude needs some blood. That's what I need. Like, we're gonna have to find a hobo or something here in a minute. Hey! You had me. No, no, you are going to China. Mmm, yes, the future may take me where you see. The father. Is it, is it the father behind him? Hmm, you see, I see the dark father and the one who stands in front of him. You chased him through the realm of the god of the sea. And you see him on the ground. You found him in the grave. It's over. Oh, it's over. Oh, God. Oh, 
fuck up. Run. Oh, your shaving cream in my ear. Uh, yeah, the tomb will light up the night sky. Oh, I saw it. Sometimes I see nothing. Disregard what I see. Bitch, I'm a Malkavian too. You don't gotta explain it to me. Look again. Perhaps I can share your dark vision. I don't know what I'm saying. Forget what I said. Thanks, bitch. Uh, a blood carnival begins tonight. Do you see? Murder. Yes. Oh my god, is this the what I had to fucking there. do to you move progress so much the, the heart pure murder chain? To the home of the stars. And then returns fulfilled and empty once again. The vision's blurry, even for one as blurred as myself. I don't know what I'm saying. Forget what I said. Bitch. Um, tell me how fate has laid the road before me. Fortune is not your destiny. All of us are important. Every time I sleep, the future plays out before me. I know the ending. It will end over and over until I cease to dream. I know your questions. For one hundred dollars. That's a hundred bucks. I need more. That's a lot of fucking money in this game. Hmm. I'm not sure. Like, yeah, I did just get two hundred and fifty fucking dollars from that drug deal. Oh shit. But uh, like, fuck, man. A hundred bucks is still a lot in this game. Like, most some of the most expensive shit in this game is like a thousand dollars. So like a hundred bucks is not unsubstantial. But I also want to like progress the quest at the same time. I don't really need weapons or anything or ammo in this playthrough since I'm doing melee and stealth. So here, take the money. Then ask again. Oh, it was twenty bucks. What the fuck? She said a hundred bucks. Okay. Um. Uh, t tell me of these final nights and what they hold in store for you. The crimson ship is not who he says she is and is going to burn. Dinosaurs? He's furious. The man with the crest. The voice in the darkness. Boss. Join these brothers. Follow the lights to the end of the tunnel. There they will go. Hmm. In whom can I place my trust? Hmm. The man on the couch. The lone wolf. All others tread carefully. Mm, that's fair. Um. What shadows seek to curse me? Where lie the snakes in waiting? No, everywhere. Some with swords, some with smiles. But I pity them. You are a remarkable fighter. I mean, she said it. Uh, do you have any fortuitous words, a fateful phrase to save me in future days? Don't open it. Okay. Who stole my wheeled contraption in the grade before six? I see the future, not the past. Hmm. I suppose that's fair. Um, tell me if someone knew the deed. Those with a lot to say usually have something on their mind. There are many unique individuals around the city. It's almost as if they're waiting for you to ask the right thing. E, for example. E. Will I stand victorious at the close of the curtain? Whether or not you win the game matters not. It's if you bought it. Well, yeah? Bye. Okay. Well, oh, hey. Yo, I never found that before. What the fuck is that? Is that a weapon? No, this is an item. This is in my, like, items tab. That's fucking... It must be involved with the... The big werewolf murder up here. In some way that I don't know how to progress. Because... I don't know. Why the fuck else would it be there? I'm, I don't think I've ever seen it before. Can I sneak past this cop? Is that what I have to do to be able to not? Also, can I just chow down on this fucker here in a second? Uh, 
Yeah, there we go. Need some blood. This guy's nice and healthy, so. I can kill him. He'll be alright. Alright, thank you, officer. No, I think I got the money envelope before I saved. At least I think I did. <gasps> no, you're right. Alright. Alright. I want that 250 fucking dollars. I want the $250. Me, vampire. Me, want cash. And now that I have obfuscate anyway, it doesn't really matter. Now that I realize I just have to do this. I just pressed this button and I, I'm good. Bye. No problem. Easy. Better stealth gameplay than second. I'm going back. I want the cash. I like cash in my hair to my ass. No, wait. I totally got it because... Yeah, I went from the inside. I didn't start from the outside, walk to the thing. I, I think I got the cash. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think I might have... Already got the cash. It's okay. It didn't really cost me anything but like a few blood points of obfuscate. To check, so. I would much rather check. I suppose I could just check my fucking wallet. Yeah, 344. I definitely got it. I didn't have that much coming in here. Skating, I'm far enough away. Kind of wasted all the blood I got from that cop, but I mean, it's whatever. I can go eat somebody whenever I get back in town. Not the biggest deal, and it's better safe than sorry, because I want big cash money. Good loading screen, good stuff, good stuff. We don't need it. Either. Okay. Back to town. And we'll... I think we get to go hang out with uh, Jeanette now. That's very exciting. We like Jeanette. We like Jeanette. Although I might do the other side this time. Because... You know, that's what I, the other one's what I did last time. So I might make the other choice. See what happens. I mean, I know what happens, but hopefully I still get the bang. If we don't get the bang still, I'm going to be upset. Because I know Jeanette puts out. That's just the facts. Alright, so. There should be someone around here I can... There's usually, like, one person wandering in here by themselves. Hmm... Over here, 
sometimes there's someone down here just hanging out. Yes, may I help you? I've never been here before. Only if you have a straight jacket. Okay, no response. Yes, may I help you? Which of my personalities are you asking? Nope. Uh, fate often answers with silence. Okay, cool. Very cool. I don't know if that's just content I missed and I'm not ready for it yet, or if that's some Malkavian shit and I'm not usually supposed to be able to talk to that. The madness is what makes it fun, though. Okay, we mean... I robbed this poor dude of his fucking watch that his wife gave him for their fucking anniversary. There's only 50 in the world, apparently. Pretty cool. It was, it was worth 60 bucks though, so I mean, I don't know how good the watch actually was. Um, Mercurio's in there dying on the couch, and we're on him out here fucking around. But I need some. I need to eat. I'd rather not pay for a hooker. I mean, I will if I have to, but I'd rather not. Hey there! Need a date? No, shut the fuck up. Alright, well. Let's go take care of me here. I got like half blood. I'll be fine. I'm not going to frenzy. When they got the same character model. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. Well, that dude's definitely a vampire. Okay, let's go talk to Mercurio. Enough fucking around. I mean, it's never... There's never gonna be enough fucking out of it. Not for the moment. Do I have anything that I need to pawn before I go talk to her? Yeah. I do. I have two bottles of estrogen because for some reason that is a recurring item in this game. And uh, I use it Thanks to sell. For coming back. I use it what to... you need? They're just used to sell. Um. How much gold for your goods? All right, here's what we got today. Yeah, I sold you that tire iron. Here, yeah. We don't use guns. Zero dollar. That is that's a name brand bubble gum. It looks like that's hubba bubble or that one fucking brand, isn't it? That looks like that might be illegal. <laughs> Wooden steak. I I thought I had like two bottles of. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Ooh. I still have two of these? Use this. I can use this. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll use these later. I'll, I'll hang on. I'll hang on to the morphine for now. I don't feel like dealing in felonies. We're going to stick to misdemeanors for tonight. Excuse me, officer. my milk oh yeah hey mercurio you're okay come on wake up hey i know you're okay got the thingy yeah but you waste those sons of bitches no <laughs> only those who fell on my shadow so one of them Fuck yeah, I, um, um, mmm, mmm. Nah, you know what? Nah, you know what, Mercurio's my boy. Mercurio, got your money, bud. I might have to buy some new kidneys to save your face. Um, where do my feet lead me next? We need to make some place disappear. A warehouse. Oh, we don't get to, oh, fuck, I gotta go to the Sabat warehouse before we get to go hang out with Jeanette. Very unfortunate, but that's alright. Jeanette's the best. Um. Who tells me where is this house of wares? Uh, there's a guy. I never met him, but I heard a lot about him. His name is Tong. Bertram Tong. Oh. One of you guys. That's the guy I gotta go talk to in the junkyard. Unfortunately, Tong's hiding out at the moment. 
Mm, the worm hides in turbid liquids. Tongue playing loca for Cerise. Cerise Borman, you know her? Yeah, yeah, I do. Word is Cerise's tongue are cuter. I don't know the details. My take that Tongue thinks he's about to get whacked, so he's gone underground till Cerise calls it off. If you want to put that warehouse into orbit anytime soon, you're gonna have to get Cerise. Mm, yeah, fuck yeah, that's his time. Let's go talk. Where is the dark daughter of Janice? She and his sister Jeanette. They run the asylum. See, like, the, the down thing is, like, you don't want to be, like, Malkavian has, like, almost spoilers in it. What can you tell me of the dark daughter of Janus? You see a woman around here. Power player. Nice looking blow for a dead kid, but, uh, personality like stone. Um, I need you to paint me a picture of someone. Who exactly? Uh, the white daughter of Janus. Therese, Therese I don't like, but I can respect her. Jeanette's different. I don't know what to make of her. She's a little, you know, in the head. I don't know. Therese is, well, like you. And I would think so is Jeanette. But I hear rumors about her. What whispers? Call me old-fashioned, but uh, I just can't talk about that kind of thing in front of a woman. Refuse me again, and I'll make you a eunuch. All right. Jeanette got a body built for bedrooms. One of our close acquaintances says they conquered that territory. But I asked the main man, and he says, you types, you know, can't or don't or do that kind of thing. Anyway, whatever she is, I hear Jeanette's a wild girl. Um, I can't hear you because I'm not here. Bye. Yeah, it's time to go get some fucking NPC Malkavian pussy. Shit's gonna be tight. Well, not really, but that's okay. We gotta go talk to you now. I think... Or do we talk to Therese first? I don't know. We'll find out. Damn it, this isn't a throughway. Fuck me, I always forget. Fucking other side. Hey, buddy. Go your own way. Move. Will you come down this... No, okay. I would kill for somebody to be in this alley right now. You're just kind of... Whoop. What the fuck? I'm not the only one who fucking saw that, right? A fucking NPC or something model just fly past the, edge, the front of the... Okay. Moving on. This fucking game is awesome. And there's these chicks with the two models, and the dude's like screaming at his at her ass. This is the best game ever made. Can I head up? No, I guess I gotta talk to the guy behind the bar. What can I get you, beautiful? Uh I seek the daughters of Janice. Uh, the sisters spawn of the two-headed god? Uh, like the only sisters around here are Therese and Jeanette. They own the place. They're both upstairs fighting the jinx. Why do you need to see them? Um, I'm a dancer. Jeanette wants to check the color of my thong. Hmm, fair. Uh, this watering hole is well kept, sir. Farewell. All according to plan. The way my thong is white, anyone can see that. But, all right. Your city? Last time I looked, it was called Santa Monica, not stuck up bit. Bogus. Hey, look at you sometimes. Oh, Therese, you really seem kind of flattering portrait of me with your turn of the century. Oh, I don't have a reflection because I'm a vampire. Just the spite of you. Wicked tainted type concealing that dirty diseased mind. Sin, you have no sin. <laughs> Let's see who is without sin past the fierce tone. Go ahead and mock me. You pull your pranks, make fun of my ways, but speak to you. You're just one big dick. Don't you call me that? Did I start calling? You can hear Tara Strong in there arguing with Tara Strong. Treat me like this. That's it, Jeanette. 
ran away from the tree, I'll How take care of everything, as always. Please Look, it's come in. Threes. I do apologize this for one, my that's sister's crassness if it made you uncomfortable. She's unabashedly scandalous, but in the club business, I suppose that kind of personality is a necessary evil. Yeah, this is the suit titty vampire. And then there's the crazy Harley Quinn titty vampire woman. Both are, are viable options. I'm pretty... I know for a fact that we can bang Jeanette. I know this. I know this. I don't know about threes, though. And I'm not going to lie. Sex is a big motivator for a lot of my like actions. So, you know, at the end of the day, ma'am, if you don't put out, I'm going to have to go with your going to have to go with your sister. But we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Uh, are you threes the dark daughter of Janice? Therese Borman, yes. I'm the proprietor of this club, and the only person in this city whose good side it's in your best interest to stay on. What brings you to Santa Monica? I wonder if I could talk to her about the fact that Mike Malkavian knows, like, the deal already. Jeanette is the freak show I keep around to lure in curiosity seekers. She's very good with the clientele, but her business skills are approximate to those of a four-year-old with a one-dollar bill and a five-and-dime. Call of your conflict with the worm, Dark One. Tong's exile is self-imposed, I assure you. But then what reason would I have not to hate that loathsome Nosferatu scoundrel? Racist! Nosferatu. They're so unclean. Racist. Um... What has brought your darkness upon him? He meddles in my affairs. He's a bad influence on my sister and she on him. If you were in my place, would you let him compromise your authority? You most certainly would not. I'd quite like it if I never had to hear that name again. Um... Can you, like... I don't know. Can you let it go with the worm? Or do you want me to... I don't mind, you know, I'm trying to do some different stuff this plate. Oh, uh, you know, if you, if you, oh, no, wait, I need to find that. I'll pluck the worm. I'm not sure the Camarilla would find that an acceptable method of dealing with one's rival. And right now, well, I very much need their approval to become officially recognized as the legitimate administrator of this. Okay, city. that's fair. Well, then can you, if you don't want me to go murder him, can you fucking, like, let it go? Why would I do that? Let him think I mean to kill him. That way I don't have to worry about him sabotaging everything. Do you realize how his subterfuge makes me look to the camera? Bitch, I need to know where the warehouse is. I am no politicking bloodsucker. I need to see the worm. Tongue and his co-conspirator's actions ruined my chance at partnership in a crucial piece of property. I do have several other promising ventures, and one in particular has been, to say the least, an ordeal. You are evil. I'd be willing to put the word out that my grievances with Tongue have been swept under the rug, but in return, you'll have to help me remove a particularly burdensome spirit from a property I'm looking to invest in. Mm, time to do one of the best fucking quests in the game! The Spooky Mansion! Fuck yeah. Um... A spirit or reflection of the living? Oh, I forgot. You're still new to this. Allow me to break you in. Yes, ghosts exist, werewolves, mummies, and I'd expect a whole lot of other things I've never seen share the night with us. Mm, got it. Um. I will do this, um, um. I will cross into the world of spirits. What needs to be done? Rumor oh, is that a personal hey. item of a ghost may be used to draw it out or excise it from its haunt. While I don't yeah, I put a lot of stock in hearsay, it's my last option. So I want you to go to the Ocean House Hotel, yeah. find an item of the spirits, and bring Fucking it one of the best horror levels in a video game ever, and it's not even a horror game. Um, If you will give word to the worm that he's not wanted, then I'll go. Oh, I fully intend to do so. You'll find that dealing with me on the whole is appreciably more predictable than dealing with some of the egomaniacs that are my peers. 
So long as our business doesn't go sour, my word is gold. Um, then I'm off to the house on the ocean. Your words are like the reddest nectar. Yeah, dude. Lay it on all thick. Let's Before go. I forget, take this. The only way to reach the ocean house this time of night is through a tunnel in the sewers. You'll need that key to open the gate for that tunnel. Okay, I will do what needs to be done, Dark One. If you'll excuse me, I've got situations to set straight. Um, a few questions. Why so much hate between you and the broom? He meddles in my affairs. He's a bad influence on my sister and she on him. Oh, I that. Um, tell me if your sister's the white princess. Jeanette is the freak show I keep around. <laughs> yeah, we already heard that. Nope, nothing else. Okay. Mine is gone. My body follows. She could put shit in her bathroom. I can't remember. No flush. Okay, cool. We got that gold ring off the floor. Alright. Time to go to the spook house. Hang on. Real quick. I won't, not as long as last time. We'll bop a little bit. Fuck yeah. This is what it means to be a goth in the early 2000s. You play a vampire masquerade. Your club's listening to Lacuna Coil. You got your whole milk. Move. We can also hit on sluts in bars, which is pretty cool to get them to go somewhere quiet so that we can, you know, drain them of their vital essences. Let's go to the house. I think I gotta go to these sewers. I would like some more fucking blood. Are you gonna go piss in the alley? Thank you. Yeah, don't worry about it, guys. I'm just gonna give him a blowjob. Don't worry about it. What's that? <laughs> Nothing suspicious going on back here. Nice night out, huh? No. Bye. All right. Sewer. Actually, the sewer entrance is that way. I should have went that way, but it's okay. We can back oh no there's one right here okay cool later fucking hate the sewers that's why i don't ever want to play a nosferatu and have to basically live down here to get around all right now if i recall correctly um we're around santa monica we need to be going that way so we need this is the direction of the ocean house, I believe. Um, yeah, I think it's right here. No, that's not far enough. It's gotta be this way. Cause that's gonna lead me into like thunder. I think that's right. That sound, uh, uh, from my memory, that sounds correct. Got a loading screen. Shit. I need to go further then. Hmm. Top off a little bit on the bum. She'll be alright. It doesn't need all that blood anyway. Alrighty. So, it's not this, which means it's probably that way. I was probably right. Because he did. I thought that this one was that one we just went through. Yeah, see? Here's the key. 
I should have trusted myself. I should have trusted myself. And here it is, we made it. See, I don't know if these are ghost whisperings or if these are my Malkavian whisper. Because, like, as a Malkavian, you get voices that talk to you in your head all the time. Anybody here? A strange assortment of objects in his head. Oh, hey. That's going to be useful. The, do the door was locked. Huh. Fucking ghosts, man. Okay. Into the spook zone. We need to make a, a hard save, too. It's been a minute. Let's see if I can fucking remember how to do this so I don't wander around here for like two hours like last time. Opening celebrates the new Ocean House Hotel. Okay, let's see if I can fucking remember where and go and how to do this. Ocean House Fire, Source of Inferno, still a mystery to officials. I remember I need to get down there. Oh shit. vases, man. Family missing. Fire department searches Ocean House for Ryan. Motherfucker. Those are, the whispers are not ghosts. Those are my brain vo noises, my brain voices, so. Nope. Well, that's where we fall through. It's under the other set of steps. asking a lot of you to have fucking eight at this point in the game. I mean, shit. Here's my lockpick. My lockpicking is at two. Like, wow. I do have points for... I would like to do another point of subterfuge and security anyway, though. Works out. 
that still only puts my lockpick at three. So, like, damn. Some heavy investment that they want from you right at pretty much the beginning of the game. Um, let's go this way. Oh, cool. Hotel hell. Child's severed head found in laundry room. Yikes. Hmm. We're back out here. Also, that's one of the... I think that's the only door in the game that opens and closes by itself. Kind of spooky. Okay, let's go this way. Find the boiler room key. Big red hell door looks pretty like uh Big red hell light. There's a boiler room. Ooh, shit. Ooh, shit. I don't think he can actually hurt you in here, but I was, but I, uh, I wasn't taking no chances. Got the power back. What the fuck? What the fuck happened there? I guess I didn't get away from the box fast enough. Oh. I have to go back to the beginning. It's okay, luckily, I can just go straight there. I don't have to go through the hole. I bumped into the bullet. Yeah, that could be it. I mean, luckily, I don't have to do the whole rigmarole. I can just go straight downstairs. I just wanted to look around to show off how fucking cool and, like, how many cool, like, contextual events there are in this fucking this area just it's all like in this one area just for this haunting shit it's very cool yeah. speed run this bitch now I don't need to come in here. Oh, okay. I'm pretty sure if I don't get that head thing, then the, that door doesn't open. Okay. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna... Quick save. Oh, it's the steam. It's the hot water. 
steam shit. I see. But like... Oh, I guess I just had to. Power is on. Now we got the elevator. <laughs> I don't. I wish there was like a way to like block. Fucking phone. And then she's gone. I wish there was like a, a way to fucking not just take damage from this fucking thing. Another body. Police say second child was chopped up like firewood. Yikes. Wrong button. The other elevator. No. One of these rooms has some shit. Okay. Ooh, it's spooky. Somehow didn't get totally get out. Understood. The upstairs key. Last yes. Night rose of the Reaper. Okay. Well, she's spooky in down there. Look at the little dog rolled out on me. Follow the spooky ghost lady. Back room? Yeah, all right. Murder, suicide, ocean house killer, possibly okay. responsible for Inferno. I would bet probably. Yeah, just get on in. Don't worry about it. Item gained. Diary. This is the charred remains of what looks like a diary. Uh, May 30th, 1958. Just arrived here in the Ocean House. We have a long holiday. We have a week-long holiday here in Santa Monica. And Ed has booked us a room for the hotel's grand opening. It's a wonderful place. Almost magical. The children have been swimming all afternoon. First two days have been almost perfect, except that Ed can't seem to stop asking about the locket I received from my mother. He seems to think it was sent to me by some other admirer. Ed can be sweet, but sometimes his jealousy can get the better of him. Hopefully he'll feel better tomorrow. Uh, sun is out today, not a cloud in the sky. Ed seems a little on edge. Keep uh, Keeps guessing as to who my new boyfriend is. Silly Ed. 
Uh, there was a picnic for the hotel guests this morning. Quite a grand affair. Ed is in a dark mood. I don't know what I can do to reassure him that he is my one and only love. The only time he seemed to brighten up was when he was speaking to the groundskeeper. Boys and their tools. We've only two days left, and thank God we're finally going home. Ed won't speak to me or the children, and I've found him more than once in the bathroom holding the lock in and staring at it. I'm afraid he suffered some sort of breakdown. I've told him we can go home, but he just shakes his head. He won't look at me. I just want to go home. Ed left early this morning, and I haven't seen him since. If I, if I haven't seen him in another hour, I'm going to call the hotel manager. Against my better wishes, Ed Jr. went to look for him downstairs in the basement. I'm going to go send Tiffany down to fetch him if, wait, someone is knocking at the door. She took the time to write into her journal. Pink. Oh, there's more. Oh my God, Ed, covered in blood, coming to kill me, locked myself in the bathroom. He's gone crazy. He keeps shouting, we'll be together forever. He'll never let me go. Someone please hell. The writing trails off at the end of the paper. Okie doke. smart this time. I'm gonna let all those things smash themselves. Oh yeah, you're right, the events are. Yeah, because it, it just passed April. It is April. Yeah, see, that's what I was missing, and I didn't feel like getting my ass kicked by all these pots. So I decided to hide this time. I learned from my lesson. First again. done lame it was telling me to use it as a physics object <laughs> I go back in here we done? Yeah, we're done with our temper tantrum. Alrighty. Now, if there's anything in here. Well, is that? No, that's a tray. Fucking door. This part's pretty cool if I remember correctly. Yep. Drops the fucking elevator on you. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Yo, I'm melee. Yeah, that is what my utensil what it's like Toy Story, but for kitchen utensils, which is basically canon after four, I mean. That's three, right? Fuck yeah. It's way better than the fucking thing I had before. The baseball bat. Fuck yeah. I remember there's supposed to actually be an easier way to do this, but I always forgot. Oh. Perfect. Unstoppable. I mean, I bumped my stand when I did that, but fucking nailed it. Hmm. Fucking chill. We're looking for a amulet. Or some shit. Do I have to go to this music box? Oh, never mind. Sorry. Fucking damn it. Bruh, you've got to relax.
Ghost is not happy. Oh, it's probably that one because it's got a different door frame and it's behind some rubble. Or it's this one. Yeah, it's this one, I remember. It's the big one. Empty. Lame. Oh yeah. Spooky the, the ghost of the fire. What am I gonna do against the spooky ghost fire? Oh no. Oh shit! How the fuck do I not take damage? I have to get through there. I think I have blood heal. It's good to be a fucking mouth. Good thing ghost fire isn't real. This must be a dream because I'm not bursting into flames right now. There's a pendant. Retrieved. Pendant from Ocean House. Pretty cool that we were able to walk across nothing like that to get up here. Some spooky ghost magic shit. Ooh. Oh. Oh yeah, I'm a vampire. That's right. Can I get in? I can get in there. Oh, the gun, you can see the ghost fire effect still fucking. Uh Yeah. Bye everybody. Thanks for thanks for coming, ghosts. One sec. I just got a message. Yes. Yes. Yes, I, I saw you. Gonna eat some fucking rats while we're down here. Fuck yes. Looks left, looks right, it's rat munching time. If I find one. Polite vampire society looks down on you eating rats, but I don't give a fuck. There's one right around here. Yeah, pretty much any access point would be good. This is D? I think it puts me over by the house. Or something. OK. 
okay. I couldn't have been. I literally could not have been more wrong. I. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna give her her fucking amulet, and we actually need to make a hard save here. Um, I want, cause I think Jeanette talks to us first, and she's like, "Hey, fuck me, give her the medallion," and I'm like, "I kind of want to give her the medallion." Your sister. Oh, hey, Jeanette. What's up? I should save now, actually, instead of so that I don't have to ride the fucking elevator up again. Did I load that? I sure did. Son of a bitch. Hey, Jeanette. How odd. I was just having naughty thoughts about you. You made quite an impression earlier. Did you come up just to cheer lonely little me? Yes. Um. All right. So I saved already, but we want to help. We don't want to listen to her because she's going to make Therese mad. And we're going to go on Therese's good side this time. So, um, I tried to avoid your gropings, but you have more hands than I have eyes. All of my selves are intoxicated with you, white mistress. I seek the dark daughter, she of obsidian, and I stole this from a spirit for the dark daughter. Uh, I need to talk to Therese. Therese is out making a show of how well her lips fit on the pants seat of the Camarilla. Did you happen to find her chastity belt or something? Uh, I have the bobble for the daughter in darkness. I can only speak with your other face, Janice. So, Therese told me you might be back with something for her. Do you have it with you? Yeah. Your sister only receives the treasure. I'm not just some silly doll, you know. All my life, my sister's made me out to be a joke. She told you I was an embarrassment, didn't she? That I couldn't tie my shoes, let alone hold on to something for her. Is that It's it? fucked because the, the dialogue... This is goth or Harley Quinn, like, straight up. It's even the same voice actress. Um, well, okay. So, like, the Malkavian dialogue borderline spoils this. It's kind of insane that, like, your character, through dialogue, like, already knows shit that we shouldn't yet. It's pretty cool. Um, I don't want to fucking... <laughs> shit hold on to the knowledge that you mean nothing to me <laughs> wow i seek not i don't want to i can't give it to her though we're gonna have to tell her no uh that's that is what she said she's always belittling that me. is exactly she's the smart one she's the favorite she's the successful one well that's not fair i'm not a fool this club's success is just as much my doing as it is hers um <laughs> your throbbings are your sobbings are driving me crazy. They're crazier. Take it and be silent. Uh my heart is open, but your hand will not contain your desire. Yeah, unfortunately. Like I feel bad but I'm not giving you the fucking locket, Jeanette. Do you Sorry. understand what it's like to have your own flesh and blood ripping you apart on a daily basis for two lifetimes? Can you Yeah. Uh, forgiveness, white daughter, but this is for the other only. Sorry. Fine. You hold on to it. Hmm. Since you were so willing to brave that big spooky place for my darling sister, how about doing a teensy tiny favor for little troubled me? Yeah, no problem. 
<laughs> the girlish charade annoys me. <laughs> Silence, woman. Um, what could I do to amuse Rainy Day Show? Or what, what deed do you propose? Do you know Gallery Noir? Down I'm just gonna go here because I, I want the side quest because I want the XP because I want the money. Santa Monica slithering in for token appearances. Yeah. But there's one thing they don't know. Uh, the whole event's been set up by a kindred trying to establish their own power click in our city. And we can't let that happen, can we? So I need some brilliant oh, goodness. To start to spoil Good to see you stare. <coughs> Swallowed that milk wrong. Yikes. Um, For you, I would face the flame at noontime. <laughs> I promise this won't take long. Take this knife. Give the paintings in the gallery a good slashing. Don't get caught, and don't turn it into a massacre. And steal the charity box, would you? Buy yourself something velvet. Um, slashing is now my existence. I'm sure Therese will be thrilled to honor your agreement when you get back. But in the meantime, get to the museum and ruin those paintings. Then pay me a visit. I want to hear all about it. Hurry up. I can only amuse myself for so long. Hopefully we'll get to, uh, um have our vampire woman cake and eat it too that would be great no canvas will escape my blade oh and there was something about the paintings hmm, what was it i can't remember oh well have fun techno well there's this we we will Anybody alone? Nope, okay. Bitch! Is your fucking Fortnite backpack looking ass? Well, we'll just fucking. I do need. I'm gonna need the blood. Ah, uh, no, I won't. I'm just sneaking in. I don't think I'll. I should be fine. I have like a half. Unless the dude's out here taking a piss again. Hey, you gotta... Oh, okay. Well. Um, it's this way. It's the building I keep thinking is a three-way that's not. Is that bum over by my house still? Because this is a good alleyway. He's a free meal. No, he isn't. Uh, I need to go in here anyway. I need to check my house. I'm supposed to go back after all every story mission, but I forget. I'll be fine. Nothing. Did I get my ghoul? Did I do that right? Or it might not be long enough yet either. I guess I haven't waited long enough yet. I have one unread email. A favor. From LaCroix. It's come to our attention that a sample of werewolf blood is made it in the hands of the local tabloid and that they have sent it to the clinic in Santa Monica, which is right across the street, for testing. The responsible party has been dealt with most painfully, I can assure you, but for obvious reasons, we can't have anyone testing the blood. Please retrieve the blood sample from the clinic and leave it in your mailbox and you will be compensated accordingly. We will get that pretty soon, but not right this second. But it's good that I did that, because that shit won't spawn until I do that quest. Or until I read that email. Okay. Let's deal with the gallery first. First, we need to talk to this guy, and uh, for reasons we'll get to later. Oh, I want to turn. I'll just get off. Hey, 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 hold on a minute there. I'm afraid you are committing a 351. That's trespassing on private property. I'm going to have to ask you to vacate the 
premises immediately, or I'm afraid I'll be forced to radio this in. Oh man, I can seduce him or threaten him with blood power. Um, come on, put me in the handcuffs. Huh. Well, Missy, that's just a natural response that people have to someone in my kind of position. Huh? The rich, the prestige, the authority. It's a tough job, but somebody's got to do it. Yes, yes, yes. These words make me feel alive. Uh, yeah, you know, you'd be surprised how often I hear that in this line of work. It's a uniform, you know. Women just can't get over the uniform. The chocolate stains are like medals of honor. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, unfortunately, if I continue to engage you in conversation, this is a violation of Code 613. I'll be your donut shop. Whisper your order in my ear. Free. Now he's all dazed. Free. Um, blood buff, blood buff, blood buff. It's always the last one that I press. Didn't need to blood buff. Difficulty of one. Good job. Fucking idiot. Okay. I do need blood buff, though, because... I'm gonna be in a fight here in just two seconds, so. That's not what I'm supposed to do. Five. Ah, oh, do I gotta. Grab the charity box. Is it a. Button cannot, uh... Oh, it's the dog upstairs. Why can't I fucking? I don't understand. I did this. I'm pretty sure I did this the first time, and it was fine. I just did the. Uh... Oh no, I have to. Use it. Watch. It's not good. Oh, I have to do them in order. I fucking forgot all about this. I'm almost out of blood. Shit. This isn't gonna go good at all. I might fucking die here. And I didn't save. I gotta do them in order. I forgot. Okay, uh. Cain, cursed by God. I mean, I need to fucking read it and save. Like, I'm almost out of Fucking murdered. Auto save. Let's check that. I have to seduce Chunk again, or Chuck again, or, or Chunk again, I guess. His name's Chunk, not Chuck. We'll see that guy again later. The fuck? Just talk to Jeanette, alright. That's fine. I'll just have to remember to go back to my place to get the. The, the deal, the the thingy, the quest, the blood quest to get the werewolf blood. Hey. Yeah, hey. I know. <laughs> well, I. Uh, well. Unstoppable. My vampire thought powers are too strong. Good to be a thought. Oh. I didn't even know that he dropped the key. You can also sneak away in there. There's all sorts of shit I didn't know about this game. I didn't know you could sneak through the fucking bars there if you didn't want to get through Chuck. That's awesome. Okay. This time... I need... A knife. I know. Okay. Cain spurns lower. Cain cursed by God. Cain meets Lilith. Cain's able. Uh, Cain slays Abel. And then Cain is cursed by God. And then Cain meets Lilith. 
And then Kane's burn solo. This fight was super hard on my uh, fucking Tremere because I was non-physical and I did nothing but blood magic, right? This fucking guy is immune to blood magic, so... He's gonna fucking kill me. Yep. If only there was some way to block or something in this game, wouldn't that be super cool? Fortunately, there's not. So I just have to fucking try again. Quick save when this motherfucker gets in here. Fire axe. Best weapon I have. Man, combat in this game is so much fun. Heal up a bit. How y'all doing? How's y'all enjoying VTMB combat? It's very cool, right? Fuck. Blood heal, come on. Oh, it's just not healing. That's cool. Super sick. Try a fucking faster knife, I guess. Maybe the knife will do it because it's faster, even though it's objectively a worse weapon. Guess the knife is the tech, because it's a little better. See, he can block. Why the fuck can't I block? Oh, 
Oh fuck, I can Veil of Madness this fucking guy? I can't like back out when he's trying to attack or anything. Like it's not like I have an option to do anything when he attacks me other than get hit. And if I'm already attacking, he just attacks while I attack. It's not like I stunlock him like he does me. See, he hits me, he knocks me out of my shit, but if I hit him, it doesn't do shit. I can't whiff punish without being close enough to get my shit kicked. Does less fucking damage than that. See, he fucking stopped. He hits me mid swing. He comes out so much quicker than me. What am I supposed to do? That hits twice. Thought this was gonna be fucking easier. This fight is so. Yeah, no block, no block, no nothing, so just fucking do it, I guess. Just fucking leave. I can just fucking leave. I'm just gonna fucking leave. Fuck that thing. Well, yeah, it's just, it's literally just a dude that's been replaced with the blood texture. There's actually nothing to it. But, like, fuck me, man. I'm, if I can just leave, actually, then. Fuck this. I'm not gonna stand here and get the shit kicked out of me for. 15 minutes for no fucking reason. I don't know if I... Yeah, there we go. Later. If I don't even gotta fight that fucking thing, then I'm not gonna fucking do it. Like, shit. That was ridiculous. I... I I don't know what the fuck you want me to do. Like, there's not really a way for me to avoid taking damage if I and still be able to hit him. I don't have guns. I don't know what to do. I'll leave. Hey, 
did the thing you wanted. Should I draw a map for you? The gallery's right down the street. I already did it. Are you fucking serious? Alright. Okay. Alright. That's fine. Figure it the fuck out, I guess. Yeah, I can... Steve, st I can turn the lights out in there. Maybe I can fucking stealth attack or something. I don't know. Again, just might as well go in. PC had failed. Okay. Well, that's fucking worthless. Um. Fuck on, man. Oh, fuck me. Man, I just fucking quick saved over it, too. Very cool. Fucking don't want to do that stupid jump attack or something. I need to just fucking like nigga teleport bash fucking. Fuck. His attack comes out when I click before my attack. I don't know what I can fucking possibly do. I don't know what to fucking do. I have no dodge ability. There's no kind of ability to move out of the way. I have no way to block. And I have no way to attack him from a distance. So, don't really know what I'm supposed to do. Other than keep trying and hope I get lucky. the attack twice sometimes or teleport fuck me <sighs> christ that shit was fucking awful unbelievable unfucking believable but we done now i'm blood ball for all
paintings, the fucking lights out, and let's bounce. God, I'm gonna have to pay a hooker to fucking feed. I'm so low on health. Fucking good gust of wind will come. And of course, they're grievous wounds, which means they don't heal as quick. Which is why my blood buff wasn't working, or my blood heal wasn't working. Damn. Well, I'm over here. On this side of town. This guy's too close. Fuck, why couldn't you be down here? Mm. Ah, need some milk. Now we can go talk to uh, Goth Harley Quinn again. I think I'm supposed to get to go to Hollywood. Eh? No, because I'm going to go to the spot where I am. Which also sucks. Huge, huge balls. Hopefully it'll be less bad now that we're, this time, as a Malkavian with Obfuscate. You. Oh, shit. What were you thinking? Hmm? About? The museum. That was my event. Did you think I wouldn't find out? Uh, Jeanette told me to do it. Shut up. I thought I could control my sister as long as tongue was out of the picture, but nothing's changed. I should have expected that you'd succumb to Jeanette's influence like all the others, but how dare you! She told me to do. What are you talking about? Don't Bust lie to me! Jeanette already confessed she tricked you into doing it. It was probably all tongue's idea. I'll deal with them later. But that's still no excuse for you ruining my museum. Well, she told me to. I have brought you the ghostly bauble and, uh, old words. Excellent. I'll take that. Yeah, she's fine. However, Jeanette claimed you did it for her. No. But let's say I believe you. After all, you've acted decently and rationally up to now. I imagine you'd still like me to call off the fool. Yes, please. Of course, Dark One. There's only one problem. If Tongue gets word that I threatened Jeanette, which he most certainly already has, it's not likely he'll believe me. So, in order to call off the feud, you're going to have to convince Jeanette to forgive me first. Um, I side with the one of the greatest power. Command me, Dark Daughter. Please, ma'am. Tell me, ma'am, please. Tell me what's up. I made some threats against my sister. Idle threats, involving fire and her impious satin cheeks. She took them quite seriously and is avoiding me. I want to meet with her and explain that they were said in the heat of the moment. I asked her to meet me at the Surfside Diner to reconcile, but I'm busy with the club and my other endeavors. I'd like you to go to the diner and promise her that I don't plan to take any action against her. Wait for her in the back booth, near the phones. Um... Roses for her when they should be stones, dear Baron. Let's simp a little harder, yeah. For all her unwholesome diversions and irritating disruptions, I should be less tolerant of her. She is my sister, however. And I suppose I'm obligated to forgive her her trespasses. I did sire her after all. Please, be quick about it. I am no longer here. Bye bye But we need to heal. 
because there's some forced combat, that's going to be the most fun. At least I'm pretty positive it's forced. I don't know how else it could be. I'm pretty sure. I remember looking up that you had no choice except to go through combat here. Oh! Fellow... No. Okay, let's go buy a hooker. <clears throat> I got plenty of cash. Got the cash, and I desperately, desperately need the blood and HP. So, unless this dude's gonna piss. Nope. Hey, babe. Hey, honey. Looking for. Um, how much will my purse be lightened? For you, honey? Fuck me. American dollars. Fuck. Best Fifty buck heel, man. Oh, this bitch. Mm. My affluence is in line with your price tag. I promise you won't regret it. Yeah, come the fuck on. I need the HP. Let's go somewhere more intimate. You lead the way. Yeah, follow me so I can just drain your blood. Come on. Okay, honey. Let's see what you've got. Yeah, with relish and mustard. First I'm lazy making out, and then I eat. Cool. Thank you. Alright, that was 50 bucks well spent. I mean, I could have used the blood pack. In fact, I should have used the blood pack. It's literally what they're for. I guess I'd rather have the blood pack for, like, a situation where I really... Where I can't find a hooker to suck dry. Damn, I didn't get messages like that. Okay. Back at it. We need a uh, you know, quick save. No, I actually just have to fight him, huh? Super cool, man. I'm a vampire and I get shot with like three guns and die. And then vampire gets shot with, like three guns and I die. But then I come in with a fucking fire axe wailing on these motherfuckers. And they're like, nah, dude, dude, the, the power of the L.A. of the 90s L.A. gangbanger is. It's impressive. It's impressive. I can't be mad. I'm just impressed. Don't know how I'm going to deal with it. I'm going to be super honest. Going to have to figure that out. But... Howdy, Fred. How's it going? We're just fucking... I've been getting the hang of the streaming shit. I just kind of started yesterday, and I finally got everything set up. We're doing some Vampire the Masquerade bloodlines. Let's try Veil of Madness. Literally can't work any less than the fucking rest of it. Doesn't that make him, like, attack the rest of them? If not, it should. <laughs> No, I'll just make him stand there. Well, 
that worked. I'm gonna just fucking blood heal our way through that shit. No problem. How does three goose dumb goose fall? Uh, I don't know. It's because shot criminal violation, they attacked me. What was I supposed to do? Hang on, phone call. Hey, hello? I'm terribly sorry about that. My sister was just furious about your refusal to take part in her design. So she sent those men to kill you. Well, I'm going to make sure that never happens again. Drop by and take care of it. That's just crazy! Help! Hmm. I escape this way? Sure fucking looks like it. Bye! Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. I will just leave. I, how will I... That motherfucker just... Just fucking... Okay. I... Hey, guys. Alright, it's time for some fucking... Vampire pussy. Once I get upstairs, anyway. We gotta go up there first. Time for the plot. You. I'm really sorry it had to end this way. Oh shit, yeah. they were the same person. You've been tainted by the stink of my Who could have possibly seen that now, coming? I'm going to make sure she never double crosses me again. Even though I oh, literally my character literally Save said it a bunch of times, up. which is why you don't play Shut the Malkavian in your first playthrough. It's <laughs> because the madness time. shit is you literally you against like, me. spoilers. I always look out for you. You know shit you shouldn't because of your craziness. You had to meddle, didn't you? I didn't want it to end like this, but you forced me. You never gave me any credit for anything, Therese. I was the one calling the shot. See, now Christian we have to choose, and we've been, we've been simping pretty be hard for threes. But I know for a fact, for a fact, that Jeanette puts out. So, if Therese doesn't, we're going back on our word. But we'll figure, we'll get back. We're, that's what we save for. That's what we save for, boys. All right. Um, uh, explain. Isn't it obvious? I'm about to rid the night of this deviant, backstabbing whore. Do you realize that despite her condition, she still fornicates with kind, no less? So despicable. So unclean. You're one to talk, dear sister. Or should I say daddy's little girl? Do you want to know just how depraved the Baron of Santa Monica can be? Those voices that are talking, those are the voices in my head. No, I cannot make them go away. I was asleep, I used to hear father Even during dialogue. I heard him whisper how much he loved you in your ear before he... Don't finish that sentence, or you're dead. Um... Do not let her exhume your past, Dark Mistress. Don't you want to hear what happened? How she became the pillar of the community she is today? Shut up. Just shut up! Uh, stop it, Jeanette. That's right, Jeanette. No one wants to hear your lies. I was the good girl. You were the wicked one. And despite that, I've always covered up your mistakes. I've taken care of you. And this is how you repay me. Taken care of me? You've done nothing but keep me down. Blame me for every mistake. Did you expect me to let you rule my life until the end of time? 
No, sister. You've had it coming since our last sunrise. Is that right, dear? If it wasn't for me, you would have never survived this long. Remember? <laughs> my character, my fucking us, goddamn Malkavian just in the corner while I was going on like... So that we could stay together. Obviously, you've forgotten. Um, yeah? Yeah? She's a control freak. People, things, emotions. If she can't control something, she gets rid of it. And you're a wild animal. You'll rub up against anything that'll take you in for the night. Then when you're stuffed and bored, you bite the hand that fed you. Uh, you were a sticky little thorn from the beginning, white daughter. As I said, to trust your net is to trust a famished jackal not to eat you while you sleep. Therese will never let you live. You've disappointed her. I used no, you, yes, I, I didn't try I to got her the amulet. Therese has no problem with killing, do you? Remember father? Father loved me. I was a good girl. I always did what I was told. You always hated that he loved me. You disobeyed him. You brought men home when he wasn't there. You were an awful daughter to him. Um, what of Janice, dark mistress? Eh? I was always good to father, but Jeanette made him miserable. Janice is what our character refers to her as because she's two-faced. He heart, so he killed himself right in our room. I killed himself. Therese, he placed his finger on the trigger once you blew his mind all over the silly clown wallpaper. Right after he found me in your bed and thought I was you. He was always angry at you. You drove him to drink. When There's a lot to unpack in this story. He died with a smile on his face. I don't believe your hollow words, white daughter. Yes, you shouldn't. I'm afraid, sister. I must write your ending in this family saga. And I want you to know, I do so with great anguish and disappointment. I had such hopes that you'd change for the better with my guidance. But so, sweet sister, is this how it has to end? I admit, I always knew this night might come. Well, any message you want me to give father? An apology? A love letter? Uh, the white must come to an end, Dark Daughter. Grab the boomstick, Ivory Prince. Uh, yeah, the white must come to an end. Goodbye, sister. And there you go. It's just like Fight Club. You do understand. It was her or me. Now that she's been dealt with, I no longer have to worry about Tongue. He's a minor threat without her. I'll call off the feud. Wait here. I like a tree. I go nowhere. <laughs> Tongue's hiding out in an abandoned oil tank at the old gas station. I'll tell him that one condition of a truce is that he help you. Our business then is finally complete. What you witnessed here, not a word. Yeah, but are you gonna put out like your sister would have? Um. Do try to stay cautious. I'd hate to see one so promising meet an end because of wayward trust in another. I may have need of someone like you in a few years, if you're still around. Man, lame, much lamer. Lame. Lame ending. Lame ending. Not cool. Uh, super lame. We're, yeah, fuck that. Garbage. Trash. Trash path. Garbage. Didn't get no vampire pussy. Nothing. I'm really sorry you had to end this way. Yeah, Don't I know. Her. Shut up! You never get. Um. Jeanette? Oh. I just knew you'd come to save me. I promise you, if you help me out of this, I'll make sure you find Bertram. I swear. With Therese out of the way, I can do a lot more than just that for you. Hey, yo, what's up, girl? Hit me up. Isn't it obvious? I'm about to rid the night of this deviant, backstabbing whore. Do you realize oh, yeah, that just you're one to talk? Shut up. You'd love the... Don't finish that. Uh, please go ahead, Jeanette. Had his way with you. And he didn't have to force you. You went limp and became his plaything. Do you think I didn't hear it? Night after night? Always the obedient daughter until... Shut up. Just shut up! Uh, go, go on, Jeanette. Sorry. Would you like to tell the story? <laughs> she makes herself out to be the virgin queen of the night. Pious as a nun. Stable as the Earth's orbit. But it's on act, isn't it? I'm the good girl. You're the wicked one. You've done nothing but taken care of me. Yeah. You've done nothing but keep me down. Yeah. Is that right, dear? If it was... Uh, 
She doesn't owe you shit, Therese. All right? She's a control freak. People, things, emotions. If she can't control something, she gets rid of it. And you're a wild animal. You'll rub up against anything that'll take you in for the... Yeah, yeah Jeanette fucking tried to kill me. Therese will oh, never let you live. Yeah. You've disappointed yeah. her. I used yeah. you, yes, but I didn't try to have you killed. Therese has no problem with you. Your father loved me. I was a good girl. I all... Yes, I, I... Um... What about her white... Was always good to father. He killed himself. Therese, if you place this <gasps> finger on the trigger, he was always angry at you. You drove him to drink, as I recall. Um, I don't. Uh, a dark deed for the dark daughter, not to be believed. The police sure did. They broke us up for a little while, remember? The first thing you did after your escape was find me. Enough! Don't say another word about that. So, sweet sister, is this how it has to end? I admit, I always knew this night. Yeah, this night. Um, do, do it, Jeanette. Take it. Take what's yours, girl. I killed her. I didn't want her to go. I only wanted her to change. You understand, don't you? Poor, poor... Yeah, I get you. Don't worry. To find Bertrand. He's at the old gas station in an empty oil tank. He'll help you because I'll ask him to. But you must keep your tongue tied tight about what happened this night. Understand? Uh, gotcha. Understood. Don't hesitate to come see me once in a while. I'm going to be so lonely without Therese. I mean, I may need someone like you sometime. And I do get bored so easily. Maybe you could come by and cheer me up sometime. I will fucking worship at your alabaster altar, my queen. We'll come back. Don't worry. We can come back later and get vampire pussy. It's going to be fucking sweet. I promise. Yeah, that's the way better version, in my opinion. Because... Like, you can come back and talk to Jeanette more, but, like, Therese is just gonna stay. I am so low on blood. Holy shit. Damn. I should talk to Bertram while I had this thing before I... I can't move. Bitch, get out of my way. Um... Go take a piss in that alleyway. Damn. Damn it. I think now that we've left the building, we can go back in now that it's reloaded. I think. I think it's vampire puss. Pretty sure. holster without pulling it out and I didn't want to pull it out in the middle of the fucking well she's not even here we really will have to come back later I'm going to her bathroom now though any fucking valuables in here no okay all right I think there's some They both have the different fucking computer, which I thought was kind of fun. Alright, that's fine. Oh, wait, that's what I did the quick save for, so I didn't have to go all the way back out. Alright, 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 alright. Let's go talk to the boy about the warehouse. He's over here. I already knew where he was, but you can't go in there. A bum in that alleyway, though. Sad. Hey, ma'am. Look who finally made it. 
thought you'd never find me, did you, sweetheart? I mean, I knew where you were. Uh, it festered in your brain that I looked for you? I've gotten good at knowing when I'm wanted. Ah, so you're who I'm waiting on. Hmm. Someone must have faith in you, Cupcake. That, or they want you out of the picture. <laughs> Interesting choice either way. Nasty dude. Nasty dude? Hey, I may not be a looker, kid, but you better start showing some respect. Because I could squash you like a freaking bug if my panties get all bunched up. You got it? Probably. By the little golden ghoul. Which was left as fuck. The world is shown to me even when I'm blind. Oh shit. A Malkavian. I suppose I'll figure out what the hell you're talking about in a month or so. Man, I hate talking to you guys. I always feel like I'm getting an answer to a question I haven't even asked yet. <sighs> oh well. <laughs> Bertram Tongue, the nasty dude. The one and only. But don't bother with the introductions, fledgling. I know who you are. Uh, then you know more than I do. News travels down the Kindred Grapevine like wildfire. And that courtroom spat between LaCroix and Nines Rodriguez is a juicy little morsel. And you in the middle. <sighs> How interesting. And survive, I did. Oh, you did, did you? Well, I wasn't worried. So why did you need to find me? What did you need? Uh, I seek a strange house of wares, oh nasty dude, for the winged one, you know. Hmm? Oh, never mind. The warehouse, though. Oh, I've been watching the place. The Sabbat has a bunch of low-life humans working day and night to move stuff through there. There's some major staging going on. Hmm. Secret sorrow and sickness. Tell me more of this Sabbat. Only the warm bloods infest the warehouse. Alright, tell me more. The Sabbat. Jeez, you are green. It's like this. We're all monsters, like it or not. I'm not gonna say the Sabbat are the evil vampires, because none of us are the good guys here. But the Sabbat. They glorify their monstrous nature. They refuse to hide it and go out of their way to show it. They're also brainless and reckless. They have a life expectancy of a vampire fruit fly. Um, what of the hapless humans? As far as I can tell, the humans seem to know the score from the way they've been talking. I think most of them have aspirations of joining the next graduating class of shovelheads. Ugh, losers. Uh, did they know of their Dark Masters? Yeah. The Sabbat like everyone to know just who they're dealing with. So if you get in there and have to bust a few heads, don't feel bad. Think of it as upholding the masquerade. Perfect. Can you uh, bring me there with uh, the shoes of air and feathers? Yes, I can. Just tell me when you're ready, and we'll leave. Once you're there, however... I have to go talk own. to the so pawn shop first and, and get some to cash for some morphine, down. and then we'll go. Um, my pockets desire things they don't have. Cemetery. All right, I guess. Come back when you're ready to go. But don't be too long, Fledgling. This isn't really something we planned around your schedule. I am no longer here. Yeah, I know I need blood. In fact... In fact... We're just gonna use a blood pack. That's all you fucking get from a blood pack? It's ridiculous. Well, at least I won't frenzy. I can chomp on some poor fool. That guy was pissing in the alley. God damn it. Yeah, that hooker I'll see. Be close. Damn it. That guy was pissing in the alley. I had my opportunity to fucking drain him dry. It's okay. Let's go talk to Mercurio and the pawn shop. And, uh, I clicked on both buttons by accident when I moved the mouse. Okay. Oh, fuck, dude. There's cops all over. I gotta watch the fuck out. <laughs> Shit. All right. That's fine. Back alleys it is. Sneaking in back alleys, I guess. At least until we get out of Santa Monica, which will be here in a minute anyway. After the warehouse, we start doing all our shit with LaCroix, and we... Our home base... Well, I mean, yeah, our home base will still be here, but we have... Uh, 
what's it um we'll be spending more time in downtown anyway hmm i guess i fucked up that quest line because heather still hasn't appeared yet my sweet ghoul girl oh i gotta get that werewolf blood too we have stuff to do we have stuff to do first before we get going we gotta sneak in there and get the, we gotta sneak in get the fucking werewolf blood give me a whole thing we just gotta watch out for the cops on the way Yeah, she's gone, and I didn't see her in the thing, so she must be. I guess I fucked it up. Oh, perfect. Oh, what time is it? Um, it's beating time. <laughs> Easy. No problem. Bye, bud. Okay. Now the blood bank's this way. Or is it the lab upstairs? I can't actually remember. I think it's upstairs that we gotta get the werewolf blood. This part was hard as shit before. But now that I have obfuscate, I don't think it's gonna be that much of a problem. Because obfuscate is uh, broken. Although I have to watch out for cameras in this. I wonder if obfuscate works on cameras. We're gonna find out. Can I open this? Four. Um. Uh, unstoppable. One of these is the room we need to be in. But I don't remember which one. Can I not fucking get back up in there? Oh, that sucks. I fucking hope I can, because if I can't unlock this, then I'm fucked. Oh, okay. I need obfuscate, like, ready to go, too. This Yikes. Oh, uh... That intimidation might make him fuck off. I'm gonna try it. You can let yourself out. Oh. Thanks. Well, shit. That worked out better than I expected. What the fuck? Oh, because I blocked, picked the door. Right. Well... All right, now I know that that works. I can just talk to him. I guess he's fucks off. Your email. All right. Got one of those doors that fucking opens both ways. Tech. Tech. No, I want to feed on the doctor again. Gotta take a bite out of Malcolm. Lovely evening. Sir, can you hear me? Can you hear me? I love watching his model jump up on the exam table and then just... Oh, is he just gonna stand there now? <laughs> there we go. That's better. I love it. Is 
special brand of jank unlike any other. Oh wait, I need to blood buff to get in here, I think. Cool, I can open that up later when I go back downstairs. Fucking dope. Please don't round the corner and see me, sir. Ten? Damn. There's a fence in there. That's okay. Alrighty. Yeah, hey. This area is for hospital staff only. I am the key ring. Feed me, then you can't see me. You can let yourself out. Yeah, thanks. How do I open this? Damn. Oh, I guess I gotta go back to the... One of these two doors. Secure console. Maggots love you. Cabinet. Controlled Gosh, substances Daddy. cabinet. Not the password that I got earlier from that room. Maybe I can unlock it from in here. I don't know. Here. Did I spell it wrong? I might have spelled it wrong. Panacea. should work. Password failed. Well, fuck. I can't fucking remember how to open this shit. I've got the key. Oh, fuck. Well, he didn't see me, so it was fine. Damn. For all the good it does me being in this room. We'll check that one guy's password. We'll go to that dude's computer. Maybe that'll tell us. Because I cannot fucking remember what to do. If I'm being super. I'm gonna quit save. In case this doesn't work. And leaving somehow re aggros that guy. Oh fuck, my blood buff kept going. Shit. Um, guy's office is over. Maybe I can do something from here. Um, 400 emails, huh? Maybe that'll tell me. Okay. None of these are what I want. Malcolm, are you free tonight? I thought you could swing by my apartment after your shift. You still make house calls, don't you, Doctor? I had something that needs to be checked out. From Paige. Um, do you really have to ask Tice? We don't have to do anything. 
if we don't want, but I really do need some help studying for my anatomy test, please. <laughs> Guess I'll see you around five. I'm really glad you finally decided to come over. And if you should want me to show you my appreciation, you just have to ask. She's thirsty as fuck. On your way home, Malcolm, do you think that you'll be able to get a day off next week? My mother, oh, he's married. Oh, that's, he's a cheater. Come to my house on Thursday, bring new mattress and curtains for the guest room. Thank you. Pick us up some donuts and orange juice in my home from breakfast. Fucked up. I don't like people who cheat. How do I go back? Let's do patience. Did I not do it correctly? What the fuck? It's not the same password? Huh. Well, whatever. It doesn't look like it's helping us anyway. That sounds good. Seven emails. I wonder if I can use his password here. Um, person no. Must be back upstairs somewhere, then. The fucking password to that computer. Let's see. Yeah, he doesn't seem to be aggro anymore, so that's fine, then. But why can't I figure out his password? Like apparently it's not the doctor's. I can't fucking... There must be a door or something in here that I haven't opened. Fuck. One sec, just got a text message. in here. We don't already check this shit. Bill menus, camera. Can I just turn them off? Password is I don't fucking know any of the damn passwords apparently. Control C to use the hacking feat. I didn't even fucking know that there was a hacking skill in this fucking game, if I'm being super honest. Or I never used it. I guess I never figured out how to use it. Control C, huh? Okay. Skill too low, make four, okay. Blood buff. level up enough to make my fucking hacking a f I can. I can. Oh my god, I have a bunch of them. Your hacking's at four. I need strength and dodge. Dodge again. Yeah. Got it for sure this time. Bam! 
It was Paige. It was his fucking mistress. That's some shit. What an asshole. Fuck this guy. Goddamn voices in my head. I am no blood. We're gonna eat Malcolm again when I go downstairs if I have to. Okay. Hey, bud. Actually, you know what? It's just me and you up here, isn't it, bud? It's just me and you up here, isn't it? Good talk. Catch you later. Oh man, my mouse got all fucky there for a second. It might have not been long enough for his blood to reset, so I don't want to kill him. So just in case, we're gonna fucking. But if I could only risk my sipper. No rest for cheaters. Well, that's not what I wanted. Don't want to kill him. Guess it wasn't long enough for his blood to reset. That's fine. We have enough blood for a minute. What's the hop? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nothing, nothing. You just walk directly in the dark where no one can see the moment you said you need to play. Yeah, dude. Straight up. Sometimes the universe just works out like that. Alright, let's... Oh, yeah, we gotta avoid the cops. We need to... Um, put that werewolf blood in the... Mailbox. And we'll get some fat cash afterwards no not that yeah what the fuck is this okay cool what's in there i don't remember if it'll immediately let us do it or not because it might no okay Sometimes, I, I couldn't remember, I the game would just, like, immediately, magically fucking replace it when I got to my earth. No, we probably have to go do a story quest or something first, but that's okay. That's okay. 32 hours, 34 minutes? Yeah, we'll probably either get to the Sabbat Masquerade Redemption, because I don't think so. Not that I had had a I don't think I had any violations. Yeah, I'm still at five. Yeah, that's one cool thing I like was, you can fuck up the Masquerade, like, five times before you get in trouble. But after that fifth one, then, like, vampire dudes will straight up come to strike, like, start killing you. It's fucking crazy. The, like, social systems that are in this game are really fucking cool. Okie dokie, we need to talk to the pawn shop first, then we'll head to Mercurio. Buy some shit off of him. Oh, I need to see if my knife is better or my... Because if that fire axe is better, then obviously I'm going to keep the fire axe. If the knife is better, then we'll just keep it. 5, 20, 12, 4, 16. I think we're keeping the fire axe. <laughs> there, copy. Yeah, I know. Thanks for coming back. What you need? Uh, do you... Have you heard anything about the murderer? No, it's freaking me out, to be honest. I'm hoping all night in Santa Monica police don't rank amongst the nation's worst. What about him? Oh, I don't know. I heard earlier someone at the pier got ripped up like that poor bastard in long boots the other day. Uh, the truth is often a monstrous man. I'll tell you, crazy stuff happens all the time, and it's like we just get used to it, you know, just going our way. Do -do -do. But this, I don't know. These killings are chilling. Armor yourself, death trip. So, did you need anything in particular, or... Oh, how much gold for your good? Yeah, Here's sorry, bud. Today. Yeah, 
a fire axe worth 90 fucking gold, dude. Fire Axe, ninety dollars. Ithaca M thirty seven shotgun, seven dollars. Police Colt Special, seven dollars. T shirt and jeans, eighty seven dollars. Bottle used. See, I don't know if this. The thing is, is like, this isn't my item. And I already gave one over to the guy who needed it. And it, so these extras, I don't know if they're just a seller, if I can actually fucking use these. Because, like, I'm a vampire. I don't think morphine would work. But at the same time, it says use to ease this. Uh, fuck it. Don't care. <laughs> I took the money out of the box and I'm going to sell the box. I have so much more cash than I did this, the last playthrough. Because I had to buy guns and ammo and, and bullshit like that. I might go buy a blood pack, actually, after we talk to Mercury. It's not even a bad idea. It's not even a bad idea. We need to talk to Mercurio first. And not get picked up by the cops. Damn. Dude, you're okay. Come on. Wake up. Specifically? I need to buy shit. Guns? Guy named Trip up the street. He keeps a few pieces. Oh, well, I don't want guns. I need I guess that's it. You know. We'll uh we didn't we'll go hit up the blood bank. Uh and then we'll head to the Sabat warehouse. I don't know how far I'm gonna get in this Sabat warehouse before I decide to call it, but we'll we'll do a little bit probably. Cause I mean I've been going for almost three hours. Two and two forty five, so see how I feel when I get there and then how much we wanna Move on. But first, hey, bitch, give me the blood. You need a fix? Yeah, I do. Give me the red sweetness. It's 100 bucks, but I have a bunch of money, so I mean, like, fuck it, right? This is the good blood. I'll buy one. I have, I have two small bloods, one's a good blood. Should be pretty good. I'm not gonna fill up because once we get there, there's gonna be like people I can drain dry. So there's gonna be I, I'll I'll be able to, especially with fucking obfuscate, I'll be able to sneak up on somebody and just just fucking suck the life out of them, just absolutely fucking rend their flesh asunder. But first, we gotta go talk to Bertram. Oh, thank God these cops are not. That would have been a pain in the ass. First, I want to check that hobo's this one specific. Oh no, she's over there. But she might. Oh, okay. Make a hard save. Boy. Ready to go. Sure am. Lead on, nasty dude. Head to the warehouse. The first shitty, super shitty area in the game. Not the last, unfortunately. I need to find a better place to put Streamlabs than on the TV behind me. Because the only way I can see chat is to turn around and then I look like an idiot. We're gonna have to figure out a better solution for that at some point. But that's all right. We'll be with that when we get there. For now, we're just going to hang out. I also probably going to pick up a better mic soon because I am using a PS3 Rock Band microphone. That's what I use. I also, my pop filter is a fly swatter that's bent to be the correct shape with old pantyhose covering it because it's cheap and it works. Been making this shit 
this ghetto shit since like 2011. Oh, look at that fucking snack. Provided there's nobody else in here. That's free. Hey, bud. Oh, yeah, pan outside of the walls there and show me that fucking textureless ground. And see, that's not a masquerade violation. Yay. <laughs> that's free. It's a free kill, basically, and it fills up our HP. So, blood in non in combat areas is almost not even as difficult to come by. Or blood in combat areas. Let's see, I can go in over there. I'm over here. Free money. Way out. Break through that one. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go through here. Fuck the front door. Um, that's just a regular bum. I will not murder them. I will, however. Top off. Right. Yo, what the fuck is going on here tonight? Boxes all in everyone's face and shit. Didn't you hear? A new shipment came in. Some pretty. We gotta save, and then begin sneaking through the fucking train yard. Seriously? Luckily, we can literally yeah, fucking turn invisible. Fuck? It's kind of pretty helpful. Time. What's so different about tonight? I don't know. Marcus is tense as a mother. The fucking invisible wall here? Oh, I was gonna try and climb up those boxes. Can't get between them. That's okay. I mean, we can't, like I said, we can turn invisible, so it's not a huge deal, but. A uh, bye! Obfuscate is such a fucking broken power. Dude, Malkavian is fucking just as easy mode as Tremere. Like, that's like two blood. Like, that's so, so free. I find the stack. It's not an actual ladder. It just looks like one. But I can climb up these boxes and get on top of it. I probably don't need to be stealthing through here, but I'm gonna do it anyway. For immersion. Okay. And when we're up here, we can get this side. Howdy, Captain. No one. Where you going, man? That's some shit. I pressed the button, it didn't fucking feed. Son of a bitch. Oh, motherfucker, he saw me before I walked down. I gotta press the button first. At least this game doesn't take super duper long to load. Lunch 2, the sequel. Okay. One problem at a time. This is a totally different route than the way I took when I first played the game, too. So this is pretty cool. Yo, we're up 
on top of the warehouse. Dude, this is way better than the way I tried to come in, the, the way I did this first playthrough. This is so much better. Dude, that's the fucking catwalk already. How do I get up there? There has to be a fucking way for me to get up there from up there. There's no way. They just expect me to go. Oh, right here. I would love to get out of here without this becoming... I just loaded that, didn't I? It's hard. It's hard. Uh, being a fucking idiot is... Uh, it's hard, but it's honest work. I'll just do it the fuck again, I guess. See, it's, it's shit because, like, you have to get close enough to be beating them, but if you bump into them, then it knocks you out of stealth. They realize you're there. So you have to do this very fine balance. It's kind of a pain. We'll quick save before I try that again. Almost fucked up big time there with a misclick. I fuck, what the fuck? I was stuck on nothing. It's very lame. Alright. Well, I quick loaded. But that's okay because I immediately was quick saved like two seconds ago, so it's not really a biggie. But fuck. Hey, will you Perfect. I'll run into less of those uh, feed attempt failed too as I increase my strength because I think I'm pretty positive that comes straight off of your strength stat. Stamina. Oh, this is your HP. Yeah, I need that too. We need to buff my physical stats more than my mental ones. I know this now that I am. Okay, so. Hard save. We don't take fall damage because we're a fucking vampire. Order a pizza? Order a pizza? Where are they gonna deliver it, dumb nuts? Thirteen abandoned warehouses full of kill on site hop heads and wings? I can pick it up. No. No one's going anywhere while we're sitting on. I gotta remember my actual, like, what I'm supposed to be doing right now. <laughs> no, um... One down? Oh yeah, I gotta plant the bomb. I fucking remember what I'm supposed to do. I think it goes in here. Oh, is ammo. Perfect. Now we just gotta sneak the fuck out. 
shouldn't be too bad. Oh no, I was wrong. Fuck, am I gonna get out with this fucking thing? Hey, shut up and deal with it. I don't care. Can I stealth take him down without the other fuckers right there knowing? Amazing. Don't you raise your voice to me, woman. Listen, bitch. That's just the way it is. Deal with it. You do it, then see what happens. And what are you doing? Oh, fuck me. Come on. Okay. Gotta figure out how to get downstairs, then. <sighs> That's a little annoying, but... I was too close to the edge. Please let me be able to lockpick this. This would be really nice. Four. Mm. <coughs> need to obfuscate, but turn blood buff off. Drop down. I can't. That's awesome. I think we're home free. Yo, the cleanest Sabat warehouse run of fucking all time, not counting all the reloads. Get through there on like one more obfuscate, baby. Actually, no, I might be able to make it through past these dudes. And not, have fun. not even need to waste the blood on it. Got him. Whoa. Your handiwork. Hey, Beckett. I mean, whoever you are. <laughs> ah, werewolf. Uh, it wasn't me. It was my evil twin. Didn't you see the goatee? Explosions always remind me of my childhood. I like to blow things up. Have you ever been... Ah, werewolf. <laughs> Not experienced much in the creatures of the night, are you? For future reference, you might keep in mind that werewolves aren't in the habit of introducing themselves. Uh, no final death for me? I hadn't planned on it. Uh, are you the big bad wolf? I see my reputation for once does not precede me. My name is Beckett. I haven't been following you per se. We've just coincidentally been at the same places at the same time for different reasons. So sorry. If Beckett I you. is the wolf that we Tell saw me, on the have pier. Have you by chance seen or felt anything strange so on the pier this? in the last chunk? Um. 
<laughs> I see dead people. The Baron's sister is herself. Two minds, one face. A ghost. Hm. I did see a ghost. Quite that did happen. Ordinary. I generally pay rakes no mind. All but a few are willing to give up their secrets. Um, the Baron's sister's herself. Actually, no, I don't want to tell that. That's it. Most of my contacts here report sensing something unusual in the night air. Like a sense of dread or pressure. But I'm not a native to these parts, so I can't tell if it's irregular. And since you're still fresh, perhaps you're not attuned to it. Yeah, I can't feel the motherfucker coffin there are that is in the city right now. Discredit. The Dio coffin. Certain. Meet again. Or never again. Good night, young one. And be careful. You're very likely being hunted by the Sabbat. Yeah, usually. Goodbye, wolf. And then... One thing I really fucking like about this game is that it doesn't make me... fucking... have to do this bullshit and, like, run all the way back through every time. Oh, hey, we're back. Hey, Bertram. Nice work, Cupcake. That, so Don't I was gonna kill the stream away. when we either got through too. that or whatever, but, like, that went way <laughs> faster than the last so time. Just that went so much better. Tonight. I went, that was so much better. <laughs> that was so much cleaner and quicker than the first time I did it. The first time I did it, it wound up devolving into an entire shootout. It was some shit. You know Beckett? Noble Sam? Beckett. Why I know of him. Why? Uh, we traded words. Uh, the dark voices told me he was near. No kidding. Huh. Must be something major happening if he's in town. Beckett is a historian of sorts. He's unearthed more vampire lore than anyone. But that's all Beckett does. Seek the truth behind our condition. Hmm. I seek to pull questions from your bubbling dome. What do you need? Uh, do you know about the murderer? Those murders are definitely the work of Kindred. Probably some caitiff getting revenge on everyone who made fun of him in high school. Once the sheriff tracks this guy down, they're gonna make one hell of an example of him. Hmm, caitiff, the motherless dogs? Ha, <laughs> pretty close to the mark. Caitiff are just kind of riffraff vampires who don't know anything about vampire society, don't know their clan, mutt vampires. What I suspect you were perilously close to becoming if LaCroix hadn't intervened. Mm. Thin-blooded and short-lived. Shine the light on the clans. <laughs> sure. A labor of the Bruja. A bunch of malcontents. They get pumped up by rousing the rabble they keep around them. Like, that's hard. Nothing breeds faster than contempt. And that's what the Bruja are all about. Jealousy and contempt. Sure. They're a bunch of I... Sure. Uh give me the goods of the gangrel. Fancy themselves loners and drifters running around the countryside and barking at the moon. <laughs> it's all just an act. Gangrel can walk upright. They just choose not to. Huh. Um Sure. Demystify the Malkavians. That's me. Malkavians are uh interesting. There's something to them. Learning to sort the wisdom from the bullshit can be some work, and uh, not all of them are worth listening to, but uh, they're all good fun, if you ask me. Um... From, like, the daughter of Janice? Janice's daughter? What the... Oh, Janice. The two-faced god. You mean Therese Vorman. Mm. Oh, man, you mm. Malkavians are really messed up. Anyway... That was just silly vampire politicking fledgling. No more. You get used to that kind of thing. Mm, okay. To my ears, it sounded like a devilish dogfight. The dark daughter of Janice wanted you to swim in the dark waters. Did you know that Janice's daughter shared the same skin? Uh, what? It sounded like fucking <laughs> shit. Of course it did. As if vampires and women both weren't insecure enough. Get them together in one Malkavian body. And look what happens. Hmm. I think nasty dude is drawn to the queen of daughter of of of, of drama. Yeah, no kidding. Now that the Camarilla's moved into L.A., Therese wants the title of Prince of Santa Monica. I guess she saw me as a threat. Funny thing is, I could care less. 
Is it beyond you, or...? I wouldn't want to be the Prince of Terra Haute. I leave that headache to the Ventrue. Besides, there's only like four vampires in all of Santa Monica. <laughs> Some kingdom. I... I seek the po uh, questions. Likewise. I don't want to tell anybody about uh, Jeanette and her being in the same skin, because she told me not to, and I'll get mad. Um, can you tell me about the sex? Sure, Cupcake. It's war out there. Um, what... I didn't actually get through all the clans, but that's okay. Uh, what... Tell me about the Anarchs. The Anarchs. Yeah, I respect what they do, with strenuous liberty and all that jazz, but they're kidding themselves. Wherever there's an ounce of power to be had, there'll be people dicking each other over. You think the Camarilla invented that? No. Um, what do you know of the one with a number for name? From what I hear, he's a likable sort, and that's no, a problem. <laughs> I, even I was like, what the fuck? Rodriguez is the kind of guy you want on your side, and more kindred go anarch every day because of him. Uh, I see. Shine the light. Sure. It's another clan. Mm. Uh, tell me about the Nosferatu. You the guys Nosferatu know. are damn good at what we do. No one even argues that. If you need to know... If you want it found, you come to us. We're indispensable. Not a bad place to be in the afterlife. Mm. Tell me, let's talk no, sure. I want more. Mm. Tell me of the the thoughts, the Toreadors, the lowest rung of vampire society. Cemetery <laughs> run off. I don't rub elbows with mm. blood suck as much. But I've seen them work people like puppeteers, and that's admirable. Now, if only they'd get off their slimy asses and put their talent to some mm, for real. feeding their egos. Sure. Malkavian, oh, sorry. Sure. Wrong button. Sure. Or. Mm. Uh, tell me about the Tremere. Those guys seem like they're Mages. pretty cool. I don't have any reason to trust them. They're creepy, and I think they like it that way. But to be honest, I don't hear much about the premiere. There's a few in L.A., but all in all, there's not that many of them. We're pretty cool, you know, kind of keep to ourselves most of the time, you know, yeah. Uh, is there any more? I... Ventru and Ventras, right? Veritas, that's it. Uh, Ventru. Well, they get a bad rap, if you ask me. Everyone likes to take shots at the man in charge. But when it comes to getting the job done... The Ventru know how to step up. They can take the heat. Okay, let's go back to the sect. Yeah. Um, we talked about the Anarchs, so the Cam Camarilla. Camarilla works. And these when guys are big assholes. Wild, you wind up with caitiff frenzying in the streets, then bloods blowing the masquerade, and hunters sniffing around. Law and order is the kindred's friend. Mm. Tell me about the Jester. Jester? You call him LaCroix a Jester? Uh... You need to better watch that question. Anyway, what am I going to say? Uh, he's the boss now. Um, back to the... Yeah. Um, sects are sickness. Tell me the Sabbat. You ask me. The Sabbat makes no sense. They couldn't care less about the masquerade, and they seem to care even less about themselves. It's like, hey, let's all spread hell on Earth so we can feel big and bad. Oops, I'm dead. Now, how did that happen? Mm, seems like goofball. All right, well, I'll leave you to your black baths. Goodbye. Let's go talk to Jeanette. I think we can get laid. I think it's time. And if so, fuck yeah. And then we'll call it after that. If not, uh, I'll call it when I get back to my apartment. Collect my werewolf blood money. My werewolf blood money, which is a really fucking good album name. Gonna have to write that. doesn't work, I can bounce on back down here instantaneously. Instead of using this godforsaken fucking elevator. Hey Jeanette, can I get some fuck? Nope, not back yet. That's okay. 
That's okay. God, this painting looks very creepy. I'm not about it. Anyway. Um, oh, right. That's what that save was for. Yeah. Go back to my house and get my money for the thing. See if Heather's there. And then I'm going to call it, I think, because I'm getting a little tired of sitting at my desk. And a little vampire now. Ooh. Ooh. Look at this dude just hanging out here by himself. See me. What? What the fuck? What? I... I that wasn't a, that wasn't a glitch. That wasn't a glitch. But I've never seen that before. I think that that was some Malkavian shit. Maybe. I don't know. I have no fucking idea what that was. I've never seen that before. All right. Yeah. God, I have so much more money not paying for guns and stuff. I must have fucked that quest up because Heather's still not here. That's very sad. That's really depressing. I almost want to reload. I, I can't reload that far back, though. Um, check my email. Nicely done. In regard to the werewolf blood, please find the payment in your mailbox. Hell, the hell yes. First move from a friend. White king moves, protects the pawn. Dokey. This I never figured out who that was. All right, everybody, and by everyone I mean like just it's just me. I mean it's not really a lot of other shit going on. So um and I, ah I was trying to not what I want to do. I want to do this. Give me get a, a nice full screen here. Of the me, yeah, yeah, fuck it, it's good enough. Anyway, it's been real, everybody. We've streamed for like three and a half hours, um, or no, it's like three hours. I'm gonna upload the whole thing to YouTube. It'll be on the channel. Uh, I don't cut any of the, <laughs> any of this shit though, so it's just all going on there. If you missed any part of it, the whole three hour vod will be on. Um, thanks everyone. It's been so real and. I'm really enjoying streaming, and I'm glad that, like, even, like, three people. Holy shit. Like, that was is so cool. I'm, I'm really enjoying this. I think I'm going to try and get it more. So, uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Bye.